Richie, congratulations on your new post. What was your initial uh, reaction when you were told? Um, oh, just obviously, uh, yeah, I was just amazed by it. Yeah, it was a great opportunity for myself, um, especially where I'm at within my um, coaching career, having you know finished playing two and a half seasons ago. But uh, I can't wait for the challenge now and linking up with uh, Middleton with England and uh, and moving this Team GB forward. Yeah, the Olympics is a big deal for all the athletes. What about the coaches? Um, it's, it, is, it is such a special occasion and um, just being involved in Commonwealth Games in the past and knowing as a player that um, the sense of um, you know, that team bond you have within, within your other athletes with uh, Team Wales and, and moving that, you know, it's going to be just another level again with, uh, with Team GB, so it's, it's going to be pretty special. How difficult is it going to be to bring all the unions together to be competitive for, for the Olympics? Uh, th that is a challenge, something that you know, we will face compared to you know, your other nations. Um, you know, England have obviously h held a fourth there in, in their qualification, the fact that they're a full-time professional team, but there's definitely value to be added from Wales and Scotland, and um, it's, it's up to us as a coaching team now, and you know, when, when we meet up and discuss that, you know, that is obviously the top of the agenda. Now, you as a coach, things have happened pretty quickly for you, haven't they, at the top level? Uh, it's yeah, it's been good. I've you know been given an opportunity, and you know I've got to thank obviously Garth Williams and uh, and Paul John really that kind of opened that opportunity. And then working with Reese Edwards has been brilliant within the women's setup here. So it's uh, you know a lot of those guys who have um, helped me along the way. But uh, it's great that I'm able to maybe pass my playing experiences through to the coaching side. Now England are quite strong at sevens. Wales maybe not so much. But the fact that you've got your role as assistant, do you think that will give encouragement to the girls here? Um, yeah, hopefully. I think um, you know, there's there's always that, or is there a chance is, and that the girls are saying? But if they're performing and playing well enough, and you know, they like I said earlier, they they've got an important part to play in this program. Hopefully, and um, you know, me being involved might give them that extra bit of confidence. Um, but like I said, until we sit down and talk with Simon Milton and about how the plans going forward are, um, you know, we, you can't really answer that. But I think. Uh, I think definitely they can be confident to it going into this World Series qualifier in a few weeks as well. So how do you see your role developing as an assistant coach to Simon Middleton? Um, I, I think again it's, it's my experience from, um, from being involved with uh, Commonwealth Games, involved in the World Cup, involved on the World Series um, and how I can kind of pass that on to, to him and kind of uh, his experiences as, you know, as leading and managing the team uh, as he's done this throughout this season with his women's experience so um, I think you know, we can we can create a good relationship and uh, I'm definitely there to help him and uh, hopefully get that uh, get that gold. Now you know what it's like to uh, claim glory at a World Cup, how tough is it going to be to come away with a gold medal at the Olympics and is it a realistic aim? Yeah d definitely a realistic aim, it's, it's something that uh, from what I've seen of of uh, the talent within uh, within the UK at the moment, there's, we are capable of uh, going and winning uh, winning a medal and winning that gold. But it's going to be tough. There are a lot of other good teams out there, and uh, you just have to look at the World Series to see how competitive it is and uh, the nations that you know, are putting so much emphasis because of the Olympics. Um, but if we get things right off the field, leading up and the build-up, um, there's no reason why we can't.